Hello teachers, this is Teacher Vine. Welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, ipapakita ko sa inyo kung paano makalogin sa DepEd LMS kahit wala kang DepEd LMS account, DepEd email, or DepEd comments account. So kung isa kang newly hard public school teacher, private school teacher, volunteer teacher, or LGU paid teacher, okay lang yan, walang problema dahil makakalagyan ka pa rin sa DepEd LMS at makakakuha ng certificates sa National Virtual Inset gamit lang ang iyong Gmail account. So ituturo ko yon lahat sa inyo sa video na to, so please keep on watching. Google ang training.deped.gov.ph And then click login. Dito, before ka mag-proceed doon sa quizzes, pwede mo munang panoorin yung dalawang videos sa morning session at afternoon session. Pero kung gusto mo namang dumiretso doon sa quizzes, okay lang din. So, unahin mo muna yung reflective questions. Yan. So, click answer the questions. So, dito naman, sagutan mo lahat ng questions. Anyway, those are opinionated. Pwede mong ilagay kung ano yung gusto mo. After that, mag-proceed na tayo doon sa mismong quiz. Just click next activity. And then, attempt quiz now. So, dito sa quiz, dapat ma-perfect mo para makakuha ka ng certificate at makaproceed sa next activity. So, in this video, sasabihin ko lahat ng answers from day 1 to day 5 para makasave tayo ng time. Number one, the answer is all the statements above are incorrect. Number two, in conducting asynchronous sessions, who among the following teachers prepared well? The correct answer is Mrs. Razon gathered available contents and select the best one which will fit her learners' needs and arrange it accordingly in the DepEd LMS. Number three, which practices in conducting online synchronous session is effective? The correct answer is, use a video conferencing tool which you can share presentations or documents and engage in a collaborative chat to give instant feedback. Number four, what is the best immediate solution if you encounter a technical problem or failure in your learner's site? The correct answer is, deliver the lesson and allow the recording of the conducted session and upload it in the common page of the class. Number 5. What intervention should be made if a learner is continuously absent in the online synchronous class? The answer is all of the above. Since nasagutan na lahat, click Submit All and Finish. So since na-perfect natin yung quiz, pwede na tayong kumuha ng certificate natin. 
just click certificate of attendance and participation and then view certificate so kapag clinic natin yung view certificate automatically magda-download na yung certificate natin so dalawa yung makukuha nating certificates sa bawat session isa is yung certificate of attendance saka yung isa is certificate of participation so at the end of day 5 Madami na tayong makukuhang certificates. This time, ipapakita ko naman sa inyo lahat ng correct answers sa mga quizzes from day 1 to day 5 para maiwasan ninyo yung mag attempt so that makasave din kayo ng time. So, eto na. Just continue watching. So that's all. Kung nakatulong sa inyo ang video na to, please don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and turn on the bell button para ma-update ka sa mga susunod ko pang tutorial videos. If you have questions or clarifications, just feel free to ask in the comment section. Thank you and good day!